Hi, I'm Mark Polk with RV Education 101. When your RV gets a little aged, there are lots of simple and inexpensive and fun upgrades you can make to keep it looking new and up to date. I attend lots of RV shows and something I really like is the look of a tile backsplash behind the kitchen countertops in an RV. I've done some tile work in the past, but for this upgrade I found a product that eliminates cutting the tile, using adhesive, messing with grout, and the added weight of real tile. It's a peel and stick tile product that's available at home improvement stores like Lowe's and Home Depot. Let's install some peel and stick tile right now. The first step is to measure the surface area you plan to cover with tile. Ours is approximately 10 feet by 2 feet, so we need enough peel and stick tile to cover 20 square feet of surface area. Check the coverage area on the tile product and do the math to make sure you get enough tile for your project. There are lots of different color shapes and designs available, so you can select one that complements the area you are working on. I always say the key to a good finished product is the preparation and planning that goes into the job. In this case, prepping the surface area will pay big dividends in the final product. Make sure any power going to the RV is turned off and remove any outlet or light switch covers from the area you'll be working in. I use a scuff pad like this to scuff the surface so the tile would adhere properly. Next, clean the surface area with a wet sponge or rag and a degreasing agent and let dry. Normally when you're working on a tile project, you start in the middle of the surface area and work your way out to the edges. But with this peel and stick brand tile, the way the overlap is designed, I need to start on one of the edges and work my way across the project area. I am using the top molding of the countertop and the door edge as my border and my straight edge. If you can apply a full sheet of tile, simply remove the backing material and carefully set it in place. If cutting is necessary, get your measurements and cut the tile on a smooth flat surface using scissors or a box cutter with a sharp blade. A quick and easy way to figure out how to cut the peel and stick tile where there's curves or multiple cuts involved is just take the backing surface off one of the peel and stick tiles, put it up exactly where it's going to be placed, draw a pattern, and then sketch that pattern on one of the tiles and make your cuts. Adding a tile backsplash to your RV is a fun project and a simple design solution to update the look of your RV. You can add this peel and stick tile to your RV kitchen, bathroom, or wherever you like. So what are you waiting for? Take some measurements, get some peel and stick tile, and get started on your own RV upgrade project today. Happy camping. For more information on anything pertaining to RVs, RV maintenance, safety, and other subjects, be sure to visit www.rveducation.com.